Shortly after a safe landing, a pilot has the back of their shirt cut off. Why? One more time. Shortly after a safe landing, a pilot has the back of their shirt cut off. Why? Is this a so sweaty? From I was going to say <laughs> yeah. stress of it. Is it every time or is this a sometimes thing that happens? Because I don't feel like pilots are buying shirts for every day, every, every flight. flight. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't seem practical. Oh, it's the type of pilot. Oh. Like it's a, a fighter plane pilot or something. Oh, oh, mm -hmm. wait, that might actually be. Yeah, because if you're super secured into your seat, maybe you would need to... Um... Oh, it'd be like physically removed out of it. Rather, yeah, for like safety. Yeah. We're not getting anything. So no, we're getting no, not right. absolutely no reaction. <laughs> well, you just keep coming up with good ideas. I don't want to. I don't want to break the flow. Were they? Was it like? Oh, I'll throw in a few bad ones if you want. Then uh, was it like <laughs> they were hanging their jersey from the rafters because they did a really good job, and so they cut it up and then they put it up on sorry, top. Of sorry, the rafters <laughs> of the plane. Yeah, I mean it's rare that I just question yeah. a guest like that. But I'm not entirely certain. <laughs> that's planes what they have do. In, that's what they do in in sports, right? Like all time all time jerseys, they they retire them. Honestly, the closest answer there is probably Tom's. Not in sense of rafters oh. or anything like that, but there's something special going on here. <laughs> it's... Well, well, well. <laughs> <sighs> hmm. I, now, I'm, now I'm thrown right off. The flow is gone. <laughs> was it like a, like a Sully Sullenberger situation? Like a, like a landing that was like spectacular and they wanted to like commemorate it somehow? I, is it actually my thought was like sweat like maybe like it was such a stressful flight and they like sweated like clean through and they wanted to keep that for some reason it would have been a very stressful flight i mean unless they they were very very good it would have been a very stressful flight <laughs> um it's not quite that reason it's not sweat but it is commemorating something is it a a, a space pilot or is it a regular mm. Commercial air regular pilot. pilot. Okay. Huh. Commemorate. So they got it. They had it cut off them for commemorative reasons. They that they successfully landed the plane, but they died, and so. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. First half of that. Great. Don't Absolutely know how brilliant. that factors into. <laughs> Well, they, it's like, you know, an EMT thing where they, they have to cut through your clothes to, like, oh. resuscitate you. Oh. I mm. love the thought process there, Ella. That was, that was really something. <laughs> is it something to do with the pilot? Like, is it their last flight? Oh, or yeah. Or something like that? Very close. Well, also the exact opposite, but very close. It's, it's their the first, first flight. flight. It's their only flight because they are a monkey. Is <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, the car's going right on target. I'm just going to hold it here. We're going to be fine. Nah, it's just swerve off at the end. I got to I gotta, I gotta take adopt the L strategy, which is say something like extremely logical so that you start nodding it at the end and be like, and also he was a man made of eels. <laughs> is it the only time you're allowed to do that flight? Like, can you only do that flight once for some reason because it's so stressful? It's more by definition. You can't do this more than once. Ah. You're right. It's a first for something. It's a first for this pilot. First time flying on their own? First time flying on their own. Yes. Oh, so nice. it is an aviation tradition that after someone's first solo flight in commemoration, the back of their shirt is cut off. So the last part is why? Where did that come yeah. from? Uh, <laughs> where did it come from historically? Is it because the first time someone ever flew alone? They, <laughs> it like ripped, like like it was such a close call mm. that like somehow. My thought was like, do they use the shirt and then like stitch it to the seat of the plane or something like Aww. that? You know, That'd be nice. they do keep it. It can get signed by the instructor, have markings on it. Aww. It's it's very much a, a. You're proud of this as your first flight. Think back to where the tradition might have come from. What planes might have looked like back then, okay. and what technology we didn't have. Seat belts. <laughs> Did they tie them to the seat? <laughs> Flags or indicators? Maybe they had to like rip it off to like signal uh, something yeah. to other planes oh. or or to tell which way the wind was going? Not to other planes. Not They're not waving it out. It was only cut off when they got back down and they knew it wasn't going to be needed anymore. Parachute. 
Oh, crikey, no. No, no. Um, <laughs> a single oh. strip of fabric. <laughs> like a bit of a, no, my thought was like a parachute like sewn into your shirt somehow and then you'd have to like cut out, cut to get out of that. I want you to picture the scene. You've got an old propeller plane. Maybe it's a biplane, something like that. You've got the student in front on the controls. You've got the instructor behind them and it's open air, a lot of noise, 1930s, 40s, 50s. What might that shirt tail have done? It was used, oh, was the, oh, okay, it was the instructor sat behind and they would pull on the, like, shirt to, like, tell them what to do. Yep, exactly that. Because, wow. because they didn't have radio. The only <gasps> way that the instructor oh. could get the student's attention was by grabbing the back of their shirt <laughs> and pulling on it and going... Because there's so much noise and so much wind and so much everything. So the tradition became no that when the plane landed after the first solo flight, the instructor would come up and ceremonially cut off that shirt tail Aww. because they knew they didn't need it anymore. Oh, that's wow, so cute. That's so it's, sweet. Yeah. 